Welcome to Science Gal Aquatics, I'm Carrie. And in today's video, well today we're finally moving fish outside. It's moving day, so stay tuned. Welcome to Science Gal Aquatics, your place for guppy love and more. Sharing the good, the bad, and the unexpected adventures of fish keeping. Let the show start in three, two, one. Enjoy. So I'm excited to say that it's finally moving day and we will be moving fish outside into the summer tubs. I'm going to move white cloud minnows, a trio of guppies, and some rice fish into the summer tubs to breed and some rosy red minnows into the pond. The weather here is finally warm enough that everything is good to go and the weather's been warm enough at night that the tubs and everything temperature wise is good to go as well. I also wanted to mention that I did move two of the Pearl Galaxy rice fish as well as three of the Daisy Blue rice fish into this 20 long right here. So make sure you are subscribed to Science Gal Aquatics because I will be bringing you updates on how they're doing outside as well as inside in the fish room. So I'm excited to go ahead again and move these fish outside. Everything's good to go and it's moving day. So let me go ahead. I will give you one last closer look at everything and then we will move everything outside. So let's go. The trio of guppies that I did pull for the outside tubs all did come from this little five gallon no filter aquarium and it is filled with guppy grass, algae, snails, and many, many, many guppy fry. Initially when setting up these summer tubs, I did use water conditioner. I do have extremely hard water here. Also, the summer tubs and the pond are pretty heavily shaded. 
but towards the later part of the afternoon, they are in direct sunshine. And that is why I do have some temperature fluctuations on the smaller tubs. So the only thing that I'm going to do to acclimate these fish to the summer tubs, because if I just set these containers in the tub to acclimate, they're just going to fall over. So I'm going to add a little bit of the water from the tubs that they're going into, into the containers that they're in now, and just let them acclimate and settle in for a while. While all the fish are acclimating, I wanted to take a second and show you these rice fish tubs. I do have four, and what I did, I actually turned off this filter and just added air stones to each of these rice fish. They like really slow water flow, so I actually put these little adjuster pieces on it so I can adjust this, and right now I have it coming out at just a trickle. So I did want to take a second and show you these tubs. And after 10 to 15 minutes, it was time to start moving fish into the summer tubs and pond. Even though the white cloud minnows and the rice fish will appreciate the cooler nights that we'll have every so often, more so than the guppies, the problem that I've had since keeping guppies in the summer tub is that it seems like it's typically the females, but I have lost a few due to jumping, so I do try to keep the water level a little lower.
Make sure you subscribe to Science Gal Aquatics and that bell notification is clicked because the summer tubs, they look completely different in just a short amount of time and I promise to bring you an update soon. But until next time, I'll see you in the comments. Thanks for watching. Enjoy!